I was in prison when I saw my very first angel. I had been thrown into lockdown numerous times because uh, I'm a bad girl when I was there. I was fighting with the police, I was fighting with the inmates, and they, so they kept on throwing me into, the, into lockdown. And so I was there again, and I had just found Jesus. I, I was trying to do the right thing, but I was still acting out of my flesh. And they told me I was gonna be in lockdown for like 90 days, and the lockdown in that facility was not good. It was not a private room with your own shower. It was booking. Um, I had to sleep on a little metal bench or a dirty mattress thrown on the floor. The rooms were covered with urine and feces and blood, and it was freezing cold. And now I'm in there praying. I had been praying for three days straight three days straight. And then I remember um, as I'm asking God to please come and visit me to, and to forgive me and to show me favor, I looked up and I saw a huge man standing, guarding the door of my cell. He was so big, he was hunched over like this because he wouldn't fit in the whole cell and he was an angel. And he had his fist balled up like this, like he was just gonna beat down anybody that came into the cell. And he, he didn't really even look like an angel. He looked more like a thug on, from the street. He did, his fist was just all balled up and he, he looked all tore up. And I remember I, I saw him and I reached out to touch him. And as I did, I closed my eyes and I reached out like this and my hand started in the natural, started going up and down. It was like he reached out and, and began to shake my hand. And it scared me so much, I, I actually pulled my hand back and freaked out. But that was uh, my guardian angel. And I knew that because later on, years, years later, I would meet a woman in, um, in a television studio while I was shooting a television program. And when she saw me, she said, I can see your angels. And I said, what do they look like? And she said, one of them looks not even like an angel. He looks like a gangster, like a thug. And I said, that's my angel, that's my angel. And she said, he's so beat up from the fight, from protecting you on the streets, that he only has one wing and it's torn and covered with blood.